Hey guys, welcome to For Tutorials. Guys, today I teach you how to create some cool looking displacement text effect in Cinema 4D. So firstly guys, I go to MoGraph and use more text. And guys, I type only S letter and alignment, take middle, change font. I use Arial black font, this one, and depth increase like 40 centimeter yes and guys i go to display select shading lines and now i increase subdivision take like 15 and intermediate points take subdivided and angle i take 90 degree and guys maximum length take 3 centimeter yes and after that guys i go to caps here and type use quad angles regular grid check and red size same three yeah great and now guys i take torus change torus size decrease ring like 100 centimeter and segments increase like 200 and pipe radius decrease take 5 centimeter and pipe segments increase take like 3 yes great guys select this torus and go on mid and little bit rotate yeah rotate yes see guys this is my simple text and now guys I apply cinema 4d studio light so I go to file and merge go on desktop this is my cinema 4d studio light this one and open select flow and background little bit down yes and guys I apply material I go to create and load material select and open now guys change background color so i go to flow and background see guys this my background material this one change go on color open gradient i take purple this yes and press ok yes see guys this is my background material and now guys i go to material editor here open this white material open and diffuse uncheck only select color and color take white guys apply this white material on more text and torus this tube sorry and now guys i create displacement so open this material gray material and bump uncheck go on color and color take light gray this is my light gray and guys i go to displacement check and texture always i use noise and guys sub poly displacement check and round geometry check guys click on noise and noise type i use this electric that's it and guys i go to alpha alpha check same texture use noise and invert check click on noise and guys noise type this time use this one and octave i take one yes and global scale take 900 and guys this is contrast increase like 95 percent and brightness increase like 15 yeah 15 is good 15 yes 
see guys this my displacement material that's it close guys apply on motex and torus i show you press ok see guys this is my text displacement right this looking really cool right and now guys i apply one more displacement material this time i apply yellow material open this yellow material and same displacement check this time type noise and guys this time serve polygon displacement uncheck only select noise and noise type use rony 3 and guys okay i go to on alpha and type use noise click on noise and same noise type ham this one and this time octave degree is like 0 0.5 yes and global scale same 900 yeah and cycles increase like 6 and low clip increase little bit like 10 change actually i take low clip only 10 yes see guys this is my material you guys you can change this seed like this yeah this one is better close apply on more text and torus and again i go to render preview and press ok See guys, my render is finished. There is my second render. Yeah, great. And now, guys, my effect is complete. I go to render setting. And MB occlusion. Maximum sample, I take 1 to 8. Accuracy 100%. Guys, use global illumination. Anti, select best. And guys, this is my output. Use full HD. Yes, that's it. Close. And guys, go on render. Press OK. Guys, I take some color correction. I go to filter. Enable filter check. Saturation, take 20. Brightness, I take only 1. And contrast, I take 10. After render, save this image. So guys, this is my simple small tutorial is finished. If you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. And guys, you can download this project file link in description. Thank you.